Hey everybody, this is going to be a flip through of another glue book. It is a composition book from Dollar Tree. I love the front cover, so I did not change or add anything to it. So let's just jump in and get started. This is just um, some paint, watercolors, nail polish, just the same stuff that I use a lot of, washi. That was some of the spray inks. I think it's Delusions, the spray inks. Magazine clippings. You know, paint swatches, old greeting card. Sorry, my hand's not wanting to turn that. I tried to use some fabric, stick like some lace, and this is like rickrack, just to give it a little texture. And again, I did not cover the whole page um, since I had, <clears throat> pardon me, put some, you know, inks and paints and stuff on it. I did try to put washi on all the edges just because I love washi so much. Those are Dilution, or no, tar, sorry, Tim Holtz um, crayons of, I don't know, they're kind of like pastel crayons. Just kind of like doodling with some different gel pens or markers. This is some brochure that we got when we was on vacation for like an art store. There's really neat pictures on that. Old calendar page. Obviously a crossword puzzle. Some packaging from some stickers that I got. This was definitely the star nail polish, glitter nail polish. My husband actually took some inks it was so I told him to do that and so this is his page he likes basketball and boats <laughs> uh, crazy <laughs> A lot of these are magazine images. Um, <clears throat> I've had trouble getting magazines because of COVID. Our library doesn't have the sales like they used to, and I've had to resort to other avenues. Now, some of these magazine images, they're just so pretty. You just hate to, you know, when you get rid of the magazine, not ever be able to have it. Again, that was on the front of a woman's magazine. Same thing like with that. You just, you know, it's a good way to have them to see and remember. Some of these pages to me look a little bare looking at them now. Uh, I don't, you know, I don't know. I guess it's just personal preference and you can't maybe cover every white space. I thought those Pop-Tarts looked so yummy. Again, uh, it was in a magazine, so I'll be able to always look at them. Tried some stamping on a paint swatch on that one too. Getting to the end. 
That's it. Thanks for watching.